Hey, what's up guys, folks? Squad Rock, some more Pokemon White. In this episode, we're going to be going and battling another trainer in the Nova region, who lies in this house in Undela City. So let's go ahead in. And we meet a familiar face. What's this? What an uncanny resemblance. It's surprising to meet another trainer who has intense eyes like that Pokemon trainer. What Pokemon trainer? What's your name? Oh, okay, I remember that. Fluffy. Nice to meet you. I'm Cynthia. I'm a Pokemon trainer, too, like you. I have an insatiable cure. Insatiable? I never heard that word before. Curiosity for researching Pokemon myths. I'm sure you know about Undela's Abyssal Ruins, right? I'm staying here at my friend's villa so I can investigate them. Ah, oh, so it's your friends, okay. In order to get to know each other better as Pokemon trainers, I would like our Pokemon to have a match. Would you care to be my opponent? Seeing as you are a previous champion, and I have kicked your butt in the past, sure. Before I send out my Pokemon, my heart always begins to race. Interesting, my Pokemon and their Pokeballs are radiating a happy feeling. Are you the reason? What are you? I am a human. I am a Pokemon. I'm getting an awesome remix of Cynthia's theme from Pokemon Platinum. And Diamond and Pearl. And I believe she does have the same team, but a little bit different than her team in Platinum because she has some uh, Anova Pokemon. But she's going to be starting out with her Spirit Tomb here, if she had in her, uh, her uh, Platinum team. Um, and it is level 75, just like Morimoto. Uh, so let's go ahead and start this fight. Uh, this is another fight that you can't do until after. Whoa, that looked weird. That really glitched out, I think. Oh, stupid. I keep being an idiot. Uh, who am I sending out? Let's do... Eh, yeah, Roland, why not? We started with, uh, extra drill last fight, so we start with Roland this time. Uh, I was just- I just recorded the last episode, so... <laughs> kinda still shaking about that story I- I told last episode. Um... That still looks really glitchy. Uh, I really hope that story was fake, though. I don't think it was, but I really hope it was. Um... But I have another story to talk to you guys about today. Um, just recently I got banned to Kazooie for the N64, because I, I know last time, last episode, I talked about uh, getting an N64. And uh, so this time, I want to talk about Banjo Kazooie and Rare and stuff. And I know this is really weird to be talking about this now, since this happened in 2002, but I want to talk about Banjo Kazooie and Rare and the Microsoft buyout and stuff. Um, so, we all know Banjo-Kazooie is an awesome game, we all know Rare is an awesome company, and when Rare first worked with Nintendo for, uh, for Donkey Kong Country, uh, whoa, oh yeah, sturdy, um, because the first time that Rare, uh, really became a second party company was when, uh, they, uh, Nintendo asked Rare to help them with Donkey Kong, since, you know, Donkey Kong back in 1981, or 1982, or whatever, um, was originally an arcade game, and uh, uh, Miyamoto and other people at Nintendo wanted to expand the Donkey Kong franchise, so they asked Rare to make a Donkey Kong Country, or another Donkey Kong game, and that's when Donkey Kong Country came into play. And this spirit team is really tough. She isn't a champion, she is a champion for a reason. Um, but yeah, they made Donkey Kong Country. And then later on the N64, uh, Rare made a lot of games by themselves, uh, the first one being Banjo-Kazooie, and then they made another Donkey Kong game called Donkey Kong 64, then they made a sequel to Banjo-Kazooie called Banjo-Tooie, and then later they made a game called Conker's Bad Fur Day, which is a really amazing N64 game, you guys should all play it if you've never heard of it. Um, but yeah, they're all, they're all really awesome games by Rare, and we all know, back when Rare did work for Nintendo, they made some of the best games on the N64, I'm not gonna lie. Really good games on the SNES too, but mainly on the N64, the games are really good. And why do you keep avoiding all my attacks? Oh, it's because you're one of those weird types that not many things hit, right? I think. I think you might be. Oh yeah, I got Sucker Punch, nice. Um, but yeah, they made a lot of awesome games on the N64. I have Banjo Kazooie later. I'm gonna get Donkey Kong 64. If I ever get an, uh, get an expansion pack, I'll probably get Conker's Bad Fur Day if I get the money for it, uh, since that's an expensive game. But they're all awesome games. And then we know right after Conker's Bad Fur Day came out in 2001, uh, Microsoft bought them out in 2002. And this music is like really loud. I don't know if I'm gonna be like really quiet over it. Um, 
hopefully I know how to edit that, but oh well. Um, can you keep avoiding my attacks? I think it's because they won't actually hit you. And I get burned, of course. Good stat- it's a good thing status effects aren't like super effective and stuff. Um, or maybe they are, I don't know. And why did I use a normal type of attack? I don't even know. Um, but yeah, Microsoft bought uh, Rare from Nintendo uh, back in 2002. And that actually does it, okay. And that was a really sad time for everyone, since that means that Rare was going to be working with, on the Xbox and stuff, and we all know Microsoft sucks compared to Nintendo, even though I'm using a Microsoft computer. But that's really the only good thing that Microsoft makes. Hopefully they can't hear me. Um, but yeah, it's, we all know it's true. Uh, what was I gonna revive? I don't know what I was doing. But yeah, um, once uh, Rare went to go with work with Microsoft, they really, their games just completely down fell. Like, their games suck now. All they make is, like, Kinect Sports games now. We all know those suck. Um, the only good games they've really made were a remake of Banjo Kazooie. Um, we won't talk about Nuts and Bolts, that thing sucks. Uh, they made a remake of Vanta Kazooie to put on the Xbox Live Arcade, and if you do not own an N64, but you own a 360, I would recommend playing Vanta Kazooie on the 360, even though it's not as good as the N64 version. Because obviously the, the uh, original is always better. Because that's how it is. But, uh, this freaking spirit tomb won't die. Um, and they've also made a remake of Conker's Bad Fur Day on the original Xbox called Conker, Conker Live and Reloaded. Which again is not as good as the original, but still, if you have don't have an N64 but you have a 360, I recommend trying. I do not recommend trying nuts and bolts though. That thing is just complete crap. Uh, but that's that's mainly all that Rare has made on the Xbox so far. And to be completely frank, those guys, those games, suck, not those guys, those games suck compared to the originals. But I don't know. What am I doing? I need to focus on the game and not t talking. Uh, who can I use to take down the spirit tomb? Actually, Jelly, Jelly might be the best one, since Ghost is super effective against Ghost, right? I think? I don't know. But yeah, we all wish that uh, Rare would go work with Nintendo again. And I think recently Rare actually said that they wanted to- they hated Microsoft and they wished they would still be with Nintendo. And in all reality, everyone except Microsoft still wishes that, but sadly, they'll never come back. At least I don't think. Unless Nintendo buys them out, but I don't think that'll ever happen. So, we're all- we're all sad, and all we have now is we can play the Donkey Kong Country games, we can play the Banjo game, Banjo Kazooie games, we can play Donkey Kong 64, we can play Kong's Bed for a day. We can all play those games, and those games are a lot better than the games that are coming out now, but... That's all we can really do, and this Spirit Tomb is just being a big pain in the butt. Seriously. Go die. Please. I don't even know, does ground even work on this? I kind of want to pause this for a second, just to go look at something. Oh no, it actually does it, okay. He's just really good at avoiding, I guess. And I'm gonna get killed. Dang it, this is so annoying. Man. All I have left is my, <laughs> my Skonry, who's not a real member of my team. So we'll get him out of here real quick. Oh, okay, that is what I meant to use. Uh, I should bring Roland back. I, I don't know what's gonna be good against him. Actually, you know what? I'll be right back. I, I kinda wanna cut to when I get him to lower health. So I'll be right back. That's not already. Oh, yes. The leaf tornado finally gets off. And finally kills him! My god! That took forever! Why is the sound over? Oh, never mind, it's not. It's because I only have one earbud in now. Uh, actually, yeah, keep. Let's make sure. Let's 
sound just sounds really weird for me now because I only have one ear button because this game is weird with its proportions with stereo. It's like one side of the battlefield comes out of one ear, one side of the battlefield comes out of the other ear. I don't know if you guys can tell that or not. Maybe we got using that full restore. I needed that. Jeez, we're already up to a lot of time here. Although some of that's gonna be cut out. Hydro pump? No. This is gonna be easier. Jeez, that spirit tomb should not take that long. The amount of, like, double teams he did. What the heck? Why did, why did that happen? What the heck? Okay. Why did that happen? Did he use that move? I didn't even see him use it. Oh god. I did a lot more than I thought. He's like five levels higher than me. Oh, it's a shield. I should get through the- oh god, Blizzard, that would've been bad. Kill it, kill it before it uses Blizzard. Kill it in the fire! Actually, that wouldn't be- See you, Grass Mixer. You did good. No way you could've survived that. Almost dead, though. Kill it, kill it with an Earthquake. Usually earthquakes don't kill people. Actually, they do something like that. Lucario! Another member of her original team. Um, I don't want to use Skarmory. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I only have Exodrill and Skarmory alive, so... Hope you guys don't mind. I don't think I have any flying types in my other- any flying moves in the other Pokemon. That's like his own- well it's not really his own move, but it's like his- oh god, that was bad. We're gonna need to do some, uh, some reviving here. This is a lot worse than I thought it was gonna be. Oh god. Uh, should we go Skarm right here? Why not? Let's see how extra drills can do though, if he survives this. That is one tough close co oh yeah it is super effective. That still was one tough close combat. Now please just don't die Skarm right here. That probably won't kill the hope. Okay, good. Just land a really good hit. Ooh. Oh wow, one hit KO. I didn't think that would happen. It's pretty crazy. Electro oh, this is a new member to our team. Electros. Uh, so let's revive Exadrill. Now we're getting through the members faster. Wow, that was a one-hit kill. I guess it is level 100, so that was kind of cheating, since Skarmory is level 100, but... You know what? That Spear Tomb took too long, so... Whatever. I don't care. I mean, if that Spear Tomb didn't take that long to kill, like, I probably wouldn't be, uh... Using that Skarmory, kind of over and overpowered and stuff, but... Levitate! Mm, I hate levitating, and he has flamethrower. That's the worst. Freaking Electros is the worst. Oh god, I thought I was gonna die there. Oh my god. Okay, revive, revive, revive. Revive all the people. Um, who, who do I want to revive? Ah, uh, Roland. You have a good chance. Better chance than extra girl right now. He's kind of dead right now. God, this is so bad. 
feel like I'm cheating with all these items. Like, I have so many items. I'm cheating. So cheating. <laughs> Using a level 100 Skarmory and having all these revives. Like, all these max revives. You only get like, what, like three in the game? Three or four? You don't get that many. Or use more than it's in the game in this fight. Yes! Okay, how many members left? Garchomp, is this your last Pokemon? I think it might be. Uh, wait. It's just two more? What? Okay. Um, who do we wanna... No one has a really good chance. I don't have any ice or dragon types. Uh... Jelly. Why not? Just keep rolling alive. Just in case. Ooh, we could do Endeavor and Pain Split. Oh uh, yeah, that might be a good idea. Endeavor. As long as he doesn't die. getting really long now. I think this fight would be this tough. Oh, he's level 77. I didn't even see. Wow. I really should have leveled up. Dragon Rush. I don't want to level up just so I have a chance, but like, I can't level up in a battle, sadly. So I might just cut again. I don't know. That might be the logical thing to do. This is just getting too long. I recently found out there's actually a limit for uh, for the file size you can upload to YouTube. It's like 20 gigabytes, I think. Oh, I just died. Okay. Well, yeah, I guess I'm cutting there. Alright, she's sending out Garchomp as her third Pokemon this time, so let's, uh, let's click on the window. Sorry about my mouse on the screen. And let's, uh, let's not keep the electric spider out. It's a bad idea. Actually, eh, I don't know. As you can see, I've leveled all my Pokemon up to uh, 75, just to make this a little bit more fair. We're doing a little bit better, but we haven't battled as many Pokemon since this is her third. She does them in a different order every time, I think. something, I guess. Even that's not much. As you can tell, I'm getting really tired of this fight already. It's been a while. It's 23 minutes on my counter, and a lot of that I wasn't recording. Shoot. Not you, Zerskate. Am I 
this place. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? I feel like it would only be fair to use Skarmor again. Like, this is just getting out of hand. I, I don't even care anymore. I just need to get this over with. Um, slash. Let's just get this over with already. I didn't use Skarmory on Gar Garchomp this time. Uh, I mean, not. not I, I am using him on Garchomp. I didn't use him on Spiritomb this time. I was able to take him down with other people. So, I think this is only fair that I get to use Skarmory on Garchomp. Especially since I'm under leveled him. Under leveled compared to him. And this is doing a lot better. Yeah. Derry's dead. Okay, good. Alright, uh, what's his next Pokemon? Electros, okay, I will cut to his final Pokemon? Or have I shown all of them? I don't know. I guess you'll find out in a couple seconds. Yeah, Electric Spider took down Lucario, and we're down to our last Pokemon, which is Braviary. So let's, uh, let's keep that on. Why not? What, was this the last time I was here? Okay. I think she said when was the last time I was driven into a corner like this. Oh, well, seeing as I died like three times, three or four times, uh, it's pretty bad, actually. Oh, uh, so... I don't know here, I can ask or not. I just want to get this over with. Yeah, but I know, uh, I couldn't keep recording fast enough. Dang, I want to just quite a bit. I couldn't, uh, resume recording fast enough. I couldn't resume it. Um fast enough to show you that Electric Spider actually killed Lucario. I don't know if I actually showed Lucario being killed on camera. I don't think I did, since I never got the Braviary. I don't think I ever showed him being killed. Maybe I did, because I got to guard jump. I don't know. I don't remember. I guess you, you guys will know. Uh, but for right now, I don't know if I actually showed him being killed, but he was killed by Electric Spider. I feel like him. Been going on for too long on my guess. Thank you for recoil. Thank God for recoil. I lost this fight with like literally last like an hour. It's already been like probably like 40 minutes early. Not even joking. Since my counters is like 27 minutes right now, it's gonna that's gonna be cut down for YouTube, obviously. But uh like half of like my recording I actually wasn't recording. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Just hit him with something. I don't know, rock smash, why not? Okay, I can do anything. And it did more than I thought it would. I guess he has level one hundred. Get Skarmory out of here. I've already used him enough. Oh thank god for recall. I haven't won yet. You haven't won yet. I won't let her be such a fun battle I need to she stops talking too fast. Okay. <laughs> too fast, Cynthia? It's been like 45 minutes now. Like, just let me win already. Let me win. Don't kill like your spider. Please. Are you kidding me? Oh, he almost killed himself. Oh my god. Okay, but if he kills me, and then he kills himself, no, who wins if we if both of our last Pokemon die at the same time? I kind of want to know if at the same time I don't want to risk it, so I'm going to heal someone. But that would be hilarious if it was down to Skarmory on my side and Braviary on the other side, and he just killed me and then killed himself. Like, who would win? Okay, he just killed himself. Thank God that fight's over. My God, that took forever. My heart is pounding so hard because I had such a heated battle with you. You're a really great trainer. No, I'm not. I suck so much. I had to use a level 100 Skarmory <laughs> with, like, good moves. Mainly I use, like, Night Slash on Garchomp and stuff. But, like, a level 100 Skarmory I had to use, like, on two or three Pokemon. I think, like, I had to use them on Garchomp, obviously. I think maybe Lucario. And then I had to, like, use, like, a million different items that, like, aren't even fair, like, they're cheated. Like, I cheated so much during this fight, and I still lost so many times. My god. That was beyond my expectation. What an exceptional battle. 
You certainly bear a resemblance to that trainer who faced Garatina. Are you talking about the story of Pokemon Platinum? Oh, pardon me, I was just thinking out loud. I love being here in spring and summer. I can't stay all- Oh, okay, she's actually not here all year. Okay, well, good thing I got her on a month when it's uh, summer, I think. I can't stay all year because there's so much to investigate in Sinnoh as well. You're a great trainer. It would make me happy to see you again sometime. So yeah, I guess you can battle her all the time now. Maybe, I think, like, once a day, probably. But only in the spring and summer, I should say. But anyway, that is the end of, like, the longest video ever of Pokemon White. If you, like, look on YouTube, like, this is gonna be the longest video ever. Shut up! I need to finish it already. It's been half an hour in my recording. So next time Pokemon White, we'll be doing other stuff. And just end it already, because this video is way too long. See you guys later.